Okay. They were going to be putting together cylinder kit for a 671 Detroit. The new bearing in there. Yeah, Got to get it pressed down in there. New wrist pin. So this is what comes in the kit, all the, the rings that you have here, the retainers, the wrist pin, um, then your end caps right there, which have to be uh, vacuum tested to make sure you don't have any leaks. take much pressure to put those in that's uh, something we don't want to go in that's to seal in the oil pressure for your wrist pins Okay, now we're going to test the seal on these to make sure that we're going to have a good seal for the oil pressure. Sign passed. Okay, we got a good vacuum, so uh, oil pressure hold good. Ben, what is that strange looking uh, different formation one? Uh, that's your expanders. Okay. Your, or scraper expanders. Of course, I always change the colors on you because you're going to run the low tension because there's a high tension in a and uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Orange, yep. Yeah. White gets thrown away. Okay. So not everything in a rebuild kit will actually be used. You have to find the right color. And that's actually the bottom of the piston. Now you know which one goes there as far as these rings. Are they color coded also? Well, the chrome flashed one is the very top oil scraper ring. The top two rings are non vented. If you okay. look at the bottom side of the ring, uh -huh. there's a, a groove from here to here. Oh, okay. That's the vented one. That's the lower one. 
Okay. And so you actually got two rings on two sets, yeah. On each each groove. So it'd be a total of four rings on the bottom for the oil. How's your uh, piston sleeve rings? Doesn't matter which one goes on that. Because yeah. your top one's keystone, your two compression rings are just the same. But the top one's a keystone cut. If you look at it, it looks like a it's a cross section of a wedge. Okay. And they do have markings as to which is the top and bottom. Okay. One cylinder. One okay, piston. so that's a piston cylinder ready to go into a sleeve. Which here's your your piston rods, which we have David clean up. It's going to get new bearings in it, and he'll attach these with new bolts. Very important to put new bolts into the uh, wrist pin. It goes on the bottom of that um, piston there.